Hey, howdy, hey guys, what's going on? This is Space here. Welcome back to another episode of Lego Harry Potter. I hope you guys don't mind, but I'm going to be doing this today instead of uh, sp creativity, space, whatever, space is creativity. I don't want to get burned out in this series, so I'm only going to be doing it every so often. Uh, some days, or some months, it might be like every week. Other months, it might not be. So, but yeah, I just don't want to get burned out in it, so I decided just to go with Lego Harry Potter. And anyways, we're going to be starting year two. So, here we go. Hope you guys are excited. I'm super excited. I love this game and uh now we're jumping into my favorite movie and my second favorite book oh actually no my favorite book no second favorite yeah second favorite book hmm. no hot dogs got it wow Hmm. Don't go to the hat. Yo, I'm pretty sure that uh, Fred and George were there too. Just so. the burrow whoa -ho. all right <laughs> so like a bunch of random stuff you can do outside but if you really don't want to you can just jump into the level back in there ah yeah that's right this is a level okay oh this boy who does he think he is it's like one of those ballerina things from uh five nights at freddy's sister location everybody's favorite game i always suck at this Press and hold Q. Press and hold Q again. There we go, we did it. We <laughs> this is this pumpkin with you, heck yeah. This video is uh, sponsored by the American Pumpkin Society, by the way. If you're wondering. Check out their website, link in the description below. So Look at this. Oh, you know a pumpkin's ready when it just explodes like that. Jeez. All right, let's go. Oh no, Jenny, come back! No, no, Jenny, no. I wonder where she is. Oh, is she behind there? Not behind the books. Oh, it was just the owl. Haha, <laughs> got cranks over there. I feel like, uh, I think no matter where you look, she will always be in the last place that you look, so. At least I'm pretty certain. 
I think so. I don't know. Anyways. Hello there. It's a Ginny box of cereal right there. Ginny uh, cereal. Buy it now. Wow, jeez, man. That was literally filled with food powder there, man. You just threw it on the ground, jeez, man. I'd have gotten all of the carpet. You know how much food powder, powder, <laughs> food powder stains, man? Why? Hoo-ha alley. Oh, hey, where's Arthur? Oh, thanks, Hagrid. Always looking out for me. So obviously, Hagrid wasn't in the scene in the book or in the movie, but they had to add two players, so yeah. <laughs> but he does come in later after Harry's and uh, knocks her and out. He's like, oh, God, what are you doing in there? He's like, oh, you know, just the usual. And he's like, oh, he's all right, what are we doing in there? He's like, hang on, what are we doing in there? And Hagrid, he's like, oh, I'll just uh, push some slug repellent for the mandrakes. <laughs> Cheers. Hm. Alright. Cool. <laughs> Hagrid's just like staring at that. Whoa! Alright. Oh, broken. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> <laughs> me saying broken reminded me of uh, a quote from the movie. <laughs> broken? There's no bones left. <laughs> Alright, so that was pretty cool. Not gonna lie. Oh, I can build this stuff. Oh, he just hurry. Oh. There you go. Take the sword. That's a, that's a very dull sword right there. It's got a freaking block in here. You got the standoff. Oh, got him. That looks like the uh, Hungarian horn tail from the fourth movie. It probably is, actually. <laughs> right. Oh, hang on a sec. I'd like, to, I'd like very much to get those blue coins. Thank you. <laughs> Alright, can I get out of here? <laughs> there you go. Boop. Oh, yeah, yeah. Whoa. to go here uh, when you're not playing levels. Whoa. Oh, it's a spider. Get out of here, bro. What do you think this is? Yeah, I can probably just jump up and get this, but I don't think I can. Yeah, there's like an invisible force field right there. Foiled again by invisible force field. Oh, it's so nice having a strong character. Hagrid. Is, uh... Oh, hey. Nice. Because then you'd have to make a strength potion. <laughs> oh, why didn't they just make Hagrid the main character? <laughs> oh, dude, you see that? Madame Hooch. I knew Madame Hooch had a thing for the old world. There's no denying it. <laughs> that book does look pretty funny, not gonna lie. Hey, Arthur Weasley. Mm. Hey, that's not suspicious at all. <laughs> He's like, hey, look at this black notebook. I, I didn't put that in there, by the way. Alright, that's 
that's a really interesting level. <laughs> Heck yeah, hairy sweater. Ha, <laughs> hairy sweater. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh yeah. Alright, King's Cross Station, here we come. Dang it, Dobby. You fiend. <laughs> Good thing they left that uh, they gave Ron the car. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, I wish they would have let you play this all out. So cool. The thing in though, it'd be just a very weird level because I mean, there's not much to the pet. <laughs> Clobbering time. Oh. Oh. All right. And then Professor Snape finds him and he's like, "Hey, you punks! What do you think this is? You mean just fly up here in the flying car?" And they're like, "Oh man!" And then. It, <laughs> No, if you're in my house, you would be expelled. But if you're not in your house, and they all in my old man, and they get to stay and stuff, and they get detention and stuff, and they have to serve later and stuff. So. Ah. Hello there. <laughs> Magical chest. Ah, oh, dang, wrong one. Suck me up. <laughs> Take me. We. Oh. Free rides over, I guess. Anything useful? Ah. No, I just want the money. I don't care about the dragon fruit thing. <laughs> oh, watch this. I remember. I forgot about this glitch. I remember I forgot about this game. Alright, watch this. It's not really a glitch, but it, I guess we kind of just watch. Look at Harry's glasses. Oh, they, they just got darker. <laughs> Alright, anyways, um, what else do I need? Ah, oh, the bone, yes. I've got a bone to pick up you, Mr. Skeleton. Oh, what a tragic end to a great performer. <laughs> I like how they always just carry around glass bottles in their, uh, I don't know, in their cloak, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> it's weird. I mean, I don't know about you guys, but I always carry around glass. I forget what the first thing to do is in this. Oh, there's Colin Creepy right there. I'm like Colin Creepy. Hoo hoo, got him. Freaking sliver. Oh, that's right. Um, yeah. Darn man breaks. Alright, here we go. Just one of you guys now, this part's probably gonna be a little annoying, so keep that in mind. Eat pain. Eat it. Eat it. Yeah, that's right, Ron. That's for not giving me my five dollars that you owe me. Break everything. <laughs> Chaos. 
Mandrake ruled world. Can I break these? Oh, I can't break the balls so on me. I've been so cool. I got these cool headphones too. Look at that Neville over there. Ha. Nice. You wanna fight Neville? Yeah, you wanna, you wanna fight boy? Oh no, my headphones, no. <laughs> It was near we hadn't listened. These guys are still beating up that guy over there. I know how to save him though. I'll be the hero. We do need another hero. <laughs> Down. Uh, where's the mandrake? Ah, hello there. What, what, what are you doing exactly? Do you, do you think you're helping? Are these yellow guys? Who even are they, honestly? <laughs> It was like guys are just like wearing yellow capes or something. <laughs> Alright, watch the streets. Colin Creek, I'm about to break your camera or something. <laughs> Alright. Near Headless Nick, you like it? It's <laughs> my new, uh, new mixtape right there. Oh, I thought for sure this would work. Oh, yeah, it does. Why, why don't you get up there, my boy? Alright, fine, I guess it won't be the hero that he needs. Whatever. Mm -hmm. Colin, get out of here. <laughs> what actually are you doing? <laughs> Yo, guys. Oh, they are. Oh, I thought they were Gryffindor. They're actually Hufflepuff. That makes more sense. Alright. I guess they're all uh, prefects somehow. Alright, cool. <laughs> I'm not sure that's how it works, but that's alright. Cool. <laughs> They're all just like clones of each other, I guess. <laughs> Alright, I think next is Charms, which is charming. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, Charms. Alright. Wait, actually, maybe not. Oh, no, Potions. Potions? No, not Potions. Uh, actually, maybe... Mm, I, I don't know, I want to say Charms, but I don't know. We're not really charms, but uh, defense against the dark arts, I guess. Oh, you man drink. Yeah. Oh, Philip, it's not actually dark in here, you fiend. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Uh, copyright Harry Potter. Take one more picture, boy. I dare you. Let's see what happens. Oh, he's actually gone. Alright, cool. <laughs> Wait, where's the cabinet? What? Yeah, where, where, where is the cabinet? <laughs> I thought there was one over here. Oh, it's up there. That's right. Okay. Filch, honestly, what are you doing, man? It's not even dark. <laughs> Jeez. Just turn up the brightness, man. Easy. Yeah, I'm not 100% sure, but I think the next lesson is, uh, Defense Against the Dark Arts, which is, uh, the <laughs> freshly caught Cornish pixies. <laughs> I kind of just has like a bottleneck, so like he was drinking or something. <laughs> we even put this finger anyway, to be honest. Go to Royal Lock. Breaking. I'm not sure why he has a uh, slivering thing over his door, but uh, okay. <laughs> not gonna question him about that. Uh, this one goes here. I always like this, just like little puzzles and stuff. There's another reason why, uh, the, uh, what, <laughs> the, uh, what are the words I'm looking for? Uh, the next one isn't quite as good. The second, uh, one. Uh, yeah. <laughs> because, uh, you don't get the puzzles anymore. Like, the puzzles that you do in this don't transfer over, so there's, like, you go to that same location, but there's, like, nothing there, so it makes you feel sad. You're like, oh, man. Anyways, does that go right here? Yeah, there you go. It's pretty cool. Booyah! Give me all the money. Oh, we can't do that until year four, so 
<laughs> it was like, oh yeah, you got it, but screw you, you gotta wait until year four, year four to actually do something. <laughs> <laughs> ah. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, <laughs> such good voice actor. <laughs> Gilderoy Bald Heart. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, after this, we're gonna call it an episode, but uh, let's enjoy some pixie fights. Oh, yeah. Look at that picture right there, that black and white one. Oh, so handsome. Look at that. <laughs> That's funny. Wow, that was pretty hard. Oh, but wait, there's more. <laughs> <laughs> Why is it always me? Never winning from the chandelier. Oh my, look at that, those pictures. Oh, so handsome. <laughs> There's just like a bunch of the same pictures around this room of himself. <laughs> That's interesting. What even is an autograph of himself? What can he why though? <laughs> Step. Oh, sorry, I don't. <laughs> or you can also like put people in bubbles. This is pretty funny. Anyways guys, thank you guys for watching, we enjoyed that episode, that was the beginning of the Chamber of Secrets, next time we're going to continue, and yeah, Immobius Unlocked, alright, see you guys next episode, goodbye.